From is a Samsung Galaxy S20 Plus, and today I'll show you how to hard reset the device through the recovery mode. So to get started, we will need to power off the device, and there is going to be two ways of doing it. Uh, assuming you have a pattern that, for instance, you don't know the code to, you will have to power it off a different way. But by default, just by default you can pull down the notification panel and press the power key right here between the settings and the search. So once you tap on it, for me, it would automatically shut off because I don't have any kind of pattern. Now, if you have a pattern that you don't know, you will actually need to do it a different way, which I will show. Now, I'm going to first explain uh, to basically both sides to the people that, for instance, don't have the pattern and it will shut off and the ones that uh, do. So if you have a pattern, you will need to basically reset the device and to reset it, you will hold power key and volume down and you want to have the screen on and the moment the screen goes black you want to immediately switch from holding volume down to holding volume up so you will hold power then and volume up and this is the same case for if you just shut off the device uh, and you want to boot into the recovery mode then you will hold also power key and volume up so once more if you pull down and shut off your device and it's completely off and you don't have the pattern you can then begin by holding the power and volume up if you have a pattern that you don't know you will need to hold volume down to first reset it so i'm gonna start by resetting it so volume down it will appear with this disregard this and right about there we go and switch to volume up which is just a way to boot into the recovery mode once the device is off and we're now in the recovery mode so from here we want to select wipe data recovery mode or factory reset i meant so there we go wipe data factory reset uh, and you want to select it using volume keys like i just did and then confirm it with the power key and once more select factory data reset and confirm it with power key it will begin at the bottom you have a dialog and the last thing you should see is data wipe complete uh, or in this case it's a ta wipe complete because uh, the curve of the screen cuts it out but once it's finished you will see that the reboot system now is selected by default so all you need to do is press power key once more to well reboot the system and it will actually continue to do the uh, reset in the background so it will take a little bit longer for it to turn back on than it normally does but once it's finished, we should be presented with the setup screen. So I'll be back once that's actually visible. And as you can see, now the process is finished and you can set up your device as however you like. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.